Our top story tonight comes from Beaumont City Hall and the office that will soon be empty for the first time in almost 20 years. Beaumont City Manager Kyle Hayes has a few months left on the job. He plans to step down in March or April of next year. Now today, Hayes sat down with our Cameron Cyber to reflect on his years of service and the projects that he calls a success. Cam's here live. Guys, Kyle started here at City Hall as an intern, making $7.50 an hour. 28 years later, he's the longest serving city manager in Beaumont history, and he's worked on a list of multi million dollar projects. For 28 years, Kyle Hayes has been coming into this building, to this office, looking for ways to improve Beaumont. The key, I guess, in any business, in my opinion, is to surround yourself with really good people. In 1993, Kyle and his assistant Angela were hired as interns and started off working in this small office. And, uh, now it's our, you know, copy room. And I, I we always did say, well, I always did say, maybe one day, you know. I'll be working for you, and here we are. Nine years later, Hayes was appointed city manager when he was just 33 years old. And to this day, his goal remains the same. What I've tried to do is, um, you know, how can we always make things better? Things like a more than $60 million renovation to the drainage system on Calder Avenue and the completion of a brand new Beaumont event center. It's a beautiful building, I think, you know, everyone in Southeast Texas can appreciate. I mean, that'd be nice in any city in America. For 19 years, he's been helping to find the right people to do the job. I don't know how to go build a street. I don't know personally how to go build a building, but I can find the right people that do. At the end of the day, you have to look in the mirror and did you do the best you could with the resources that we've had? and. Did we make things better? And I think we definitely have. Now, Hayes is looking forward to retirement and what comes with it. I'll be really in a position to do kind of what I want to do when I want to do it, uh, which will be nice and, and probably do some things with by myself and also with my dad and my brother. And his coworkers know he'll be hard to replace. And uh, we're going to truly, truly miss him. Hayes will retire sometime in April next year, at which point Beaumont City Council will have to vote on his replacement. I'm live at Beaumont City Hall, Cameron Seibert, 12 News.